just tell us a little bit more about how how the Queen is viewed uh, around how the Queen was viewed around the world and why this is such a global news story. There's really been an avalanche of. Uh of reactions, Tom. So the latest I'm seeing is from the Pakistani president who's hailing her as a great and beneficent ruler. And just a few moments before that, um, uh, Prime Minister Trudeau of Canada said that she represented an important part of history. And that was just after the Governor General of Canada uh, saying that uh, Canadians will mourn her loss and take a moment to honour her in each of our own ways. So quite a, a sort of personal touching tribute there, I thought. Uh, quite a few statements now from the UN uh, Secretary General, uh, uh, Antonio Guterres, uh, who has paid tribute to her grace, dignity, and dedication. Uh, the White House in the United States saying that uh, the uh, the thoughts of the Biden administration are with uh, Queen Elizabeth's family. Uh, and with the people of the United Kingdom, the president of Ireland uh, paying tribute to a remarkable friend of Ireland. And, of course, Emmanuel Macron, as you mentioned, a friend of France. He said someone who uh, put their mark on the century like nobody else, a spirit of service. So those same themes of dedication, uh, d dedication, service, uh, and really gratitude uh, from, from all, all around the world, not just countries that have historic links with the UK or the Commonwealth.